Could you burn more fat if you were eating spicy peppers? What about perform better at sports? Many pepper extracts in supplements promise to do this, and there's good data behind it, but there's one that I can consistently remember as being different from the many others out there, being fennel capsaicin, Axovite. This ingredient has a lot of data behind it, a chemical differentiation, it being fennel capsaicin, which makes it not spicy and maybe chemically altered to work differently. And it started to pick up steam in products on market. So let's talk about where you can find it and what it'll do for you. The most recent place that I've seen Axovite that is really cool and interesting to me is the fat burning stack from Unmatched Supplements from Chris Gethin. With 100 milligrams, it actually can improve performance and fat burning here. The formula overall is packed with a lot of really interesting interesting and cool ingredients, what you would expect from Unmatched. But the inclusion of Axovite shows me that they're paying attention to the details out there and not just interested in fat burning, but also some performance as well. What's cool about the chemical change is that it actually can improve bioavailability. So if you're doing a fat burner, you don't need to use as much. A great example is Muscle Tex. With Alpha Test Thermo, they included 62.5 milligrams, which is a clinical dosage for fat metabolism. And if you're not looking for the performance benefits because this is a fat burner, you can get away with a lot more while using a lot less here because it's not just a normal capsaicin. Saying just fat burning though is not enough. Lipid metabolism, appetite regulation, insulin sensitivity. This ingredient does a lot with a very small dosage. And the best thing is that because it's been chemically altered, it does not have the actual spice of peppers. In fact, at Supply Side East last year, the distributors of Axovite, C Nutrition, put it in a C4 drink for me to taste. I think it was like blue raspberry or something. You'd imagine putting hot peppers inside of that, you'd taste it a lot, but I couldn't notice a thing. Thing. There's a lot of products out there with Axvite and it's growing every day. We could talk about an ingredient as it's coming out and the cool things about it, but as it hits market, it's going to be part of broader formulas and how it fits into those things is going to change formula to formula. So let me know below, which Axvite formula would you use?